and we're recording. How about I hit that F7 button, and how about we get Janice in the front, and then hit the F7 button, and hey, we're here. What's up? Okay. <laughs> um, we're going to do level four, and uh, tip it up housekeeping issues, your condition, which absolutely blows, requires me to get a potion, so I'm going to go do that. Okay, how about I explain that real quick? Yeah, go for it. Basically, basically, Oyster can't leave any room that he enters in the dungeon with as much health as he had coming in. Mm -hmm. um, so he just has to get damaged every time he goes into a room. And once he gets down to the lowest amount of health he can have, he can use a potion and like, do that again. But, you know... But, you know... It's gonna be hard. It's also, what you live for, um, Oyster. Question. That's not what I or it's what a piece of the masses. Anyway, question. Um, since I have the blue ring, oftentimes I get hit, but I don't lose health. Does that count, or do I actually have to lose a measure of health? Well, um, I don't really care. Cool. That'll make it slightly easier. Especially if I encounter, like, Stalbos or Gibdos or something with incredibly up damage stuff. So that sounded like you were like orgasming of being in one of my videos. That was really scary and never do that again, please. Oh my god. What? It was a legitimate <laughs> sentiment. You're oh. sure, sure, sure. How much, how much damage do those guys do to you? Uh, two hearts apiece. <laughs> I love that, man. I love that. I, I don't. Come on, P-Hat. Come on over. Oh. Stop fucking spinning around like you're fucking oblivious to the world on an acid trip, alright? Fucking slow down and stop so I can hit you with the fucking sword and move that goddamn block and get the fucking thank you. Alright. Dude. Oh, that you You killed them all and that appears? That's I can't move the block and the are all dead. That's That's horrifying. Ow! Fuck! <laughs> <laughs> oh god damn it! Not even oh, in the God. dungeon yet. So, why not go over here and use the fucking teleporter, because I have the fucking bracelet thing that somehow magically allows me to move boulders. Like so.
to it. You know, right like, here. We're me. in the dungeon. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Okay, Shit, I don't can, have the if camera. a room doesn't have enemies, then you can not get hurt and just go on. Just clear that up right now, I think. I was planning on it have to get hit by this guy. Oh, boy. Oh, I already got hit by him, so let's keep Dude, it. Uh, you don't even have a candle. Nope, I don't. And, damn. What? That's just a really shitty concept, to just have you, like, wander around, you know, until you find the shop that happens to have the candle and then you wander around until there maybe you find the level or something and then you go to the room and you know maybe if you went to that level first you didn't have the candle and maybe you had a bunch of really shitty items you'd wander around getting stuck getting fucked up by those fireballs and shit just because you didn't wander around in the right places in the right order most shops carry the candle i just never really had 60 rupees to go get one did this game come with like a player's guide or yes. something it came with a full map of the overworld. Didn't list shops or anything, but you know, it was a full map of the overworld. Fuck these guys. Oh shit, I can't get hit. There we go. Um, okay, that, that makes it a little bit better because, like, the overworld, you just can't. There, I don't think there's really any distinguishing anything on it, you know? Yeah. It's all. It's, it's not completely the fault of, like, the primitive tiles, but it's just. <laughs> it all looks exactly the same. <laughs> <laughs> but it, it did come up with a map of the overworld, and um, I think a map of all the dungeons, too. You know, I have the player guide, right? Well, the, the instruction manual for the Japanese disk system copy. In, oh. In a tub a little over to my left. I can go. Did you ever live in Japan? I lived there for a year. Oh, exchange program or something? Uh, yeah, so you brought it. That's not bad, man. Yeah, I... I fully enjoyed it, and I picked up, you know, a Famicom and a disc system, a bunch of games for Do any train groping? No, I am not a Chikon. A what? Chikon. Define Chikon. Um, the literal definition for it is sexual deviant, but a chain groper. Train groper, rather. Chain, train well, groper. Yes, I, I it, groper. How much health did you enter this room with? Uh... Four hearts. Okay, I feel okay now. And I got a Oh heart. look, it's an, it's oh look, it's the magic book. Maybe you can look up how to get the fucking wand, asshole. It's in level eight. Fuck you. What? It is. <laughs> 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 Why the fuck they give it to you now? I don't know. What does it do? What does it do? Oh wait. Where do we want to go in there? I forgot. Is it this one? It's that one. Okay. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, so that's where they got the idea in Parallel Worlds. You know, I never thought about that. I guess so. I mean, it probably started with, like, a... With just, like, a tile glitch that... No, keep... In, this... Oh. And then their negligence. From their negligence, they're like, oh, it's not a tile glitch, it's a feature. Yeah. Um, that one is a two-way, but this one I came through here is a one-way. Oh... Um, at the end of this dungeon, uh, I'll show you one that really, really fucks you over. Yeah, that sounds pretty Zelda 1 for the NES to me. Yep. Especially Second Quest Zelda 1 for the NES. Yep. How long did you want her until you first found it? A uh, very long time. Um, I'm at half a heart. I'm gonna have to use my potion. Yeah, it's time for you to use that. Especially with you picked up Windows thing? The two dose thing. Oh, it's the two dose. I just got, I just, got, I, just got, I just got the colors mixed up. Oh, oh shit, cock. Well, well, come on. What's wrong? I. You can tell me. Forgot to get a heart. I, the one heart I didn't pick up in the Raka video. So? Yeah, would have made life easier. Okay. I'm not going through Dodongos, Dodongos. Never have I been so glad to not care about something. Oh, you're, you're such a oh, great oh. guy. You're so compassionate about my playing. You're playing. Yeah. That's the thing. It's sort of unimportant by definition, isn't it? Why can't I? Oh, that's 
right, what's this? That's the wall. No, it's actually water. If I remember correctly. But, you know, the concept's the same. So, uh, yeah. You don't have a map. Nope. I passed it. Here it is. Leave your money or your life. Or life or money. Or whatever. Oh my god. Stab him. You gotta use some self-defense. Wait, is that... That's... Okay, is that yeah, a yeah. heart? That's or a heart, heart container? That's a heart container. Jesus Christ! You leave your heart container. So... You can run away, but that's how he opens the door to advance. You, you, yeah, you can only go through if you leave 50 rupees or a heart. What a fucker. Yeah. Man, I remember some of the shit these old men would say to you in this game. Um, okay. Here's what the guy said to me. Eastmost Peninsula is the key. It is the key in that particular dungeon. It's with the Triforces. Yeah, but... Dude, what if you just said that to someone? <laughs> what would fucking mean anything? You know, he doesn't even highlight any of the words. I, I only saw one color. You know, so how the fuck was I supposed to know which words were the important ones? You know where I can find some sailors? What can you tell me about the force? Well, Shin, Shin Mutsu didn't quite do that. I'm looking for the like, man that killed my father. Except maybe like... Oh yeah! There were a couple of, like, homeless guys who, like, give you riddles, like, Oh, so you want to find directions to get downtown? Why do rivers flow? <laughs> what? Alright, um... That was, was that the boss? Yeah, that was the boss. Here is the thing, though. There is the Triforce, sitting right there happily. So you get the yeah. Triforce, you gotta go all the way back to the dungeon again. I'm not gonna do that. Sorry, what? If you get the Triforce, you have to go all the way back through the dungeon again. So what are you going for now? The the treasure of the dungeon. Which is not the magic book. The oh, that's pretty good. Believe. Because the magic book doesn't count. Exactly. Um... Boy, they really make you work for this. Inflate! Bitches! Oh! God damn it! To be fair, but to be fair, in this game they really don't do much. You know, they don't. They don't make any sort of threatening motions. It's actually pretty easy to avoid them. So it makes you wonder why they insisted on calling them an enemy. You know, I might have to kill myself in this dungeon. <laughs> I'm serious. I have one bomb. If I don't, dude, kill this that, is go. way the inspiration for Parallel Worlds. Shit! You know, place with fucking demons. I gotta kill myself. I tell you that. You can't. Okay, you can't stab him. Can't use the boomerang or whatever the. They are only susceptible uh, to bombs. Only bombs. Only bombs. Holy shit! You don't have a rewind, do you? Oh, well. The flute has that going back to the start, right? Nope. What the fuck does it do? Nothing. It breaks up Dig Dogger in this game. Oh. I thought it killed... I don't feel so bad. Well, I don't know. I mean, you, you keep saying, like, you're gonna edit this out, right? Like, I don't know. Well, basically, if I say stuff like that and you leave it in, it makes you look like an asshole. Well, so. actually, I'm considering leaving it in just to make you look like an asshole. Oh. Yeah.
It's just for their reaction or something, but I don't know. It's just not. It's just not. Um. Behavior that implies a healthy psychology. They're old men, dude. What it, what happens when you get old? Your synapses decay and you go psycho. Ah, senility. Oh, there. Well, now you now you're good to go, right? Aren't they like up next? Oh shit. Oh shit. Start recording. All right. Oh god, my okay. Oh Jesus Christ. This is getting chaotic. I hope you don't die. Fade out. Yeah, uh we were at Fade. recording time uh twenty nine minutes and like forty seconds, so I stopped and started pretty make quick. Uh, oh I see. Yeah. Damn, you are a professional man. <laughs> Forgive, forgive my insults and belittlements. You are a professional. Aw, uh, thanks. I appreciate <laughs> it. Alright, um, this is not the room. Oh my god. What? It's... Motherfucker, that was the room! Hi. Wait, did you just appear somewhere else? I just load stated. Okay. That, okay. That, that was the room Jesus that Christ, I was going so, to. Uh, it's so punitive. Yeah, if I. Yeah, you don't want to know what just happened. I'll explain it in a little bit. After I get back to this. Room. Oh, is that is isn't that the thing you were intending to show me where you? Yes. Get really fucked over. Yes, that was it. Well, man, don't consider it a failure. Oh, you just consider God. it part of your demonstration of this game, because that's what it is. It's demonstrating every facet of it. And if this video ends up being a, a horrible piece of shit, at least it'll be reflective shit. of the game. Shit! Holy shit, dude. <laughs> oh, man. You want me to cut you slack on the condition? Uh, well, you know, I already hit the half health, so I wrap around. I don't care. Oh, well. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, let's just call it that rule. You know what? I'm not, I'm not just gonna round everything down for you. Just fuck you over whenever I can. <laughs> Cause that's not really where I get my kicks. Oh, you know, I'm all about balance. You fuck over someone a little bit. You know, you fuck over them. You fuck them over enough to make them squeal a little bit. Then you know, if you if you hit them too hard too soon, they just get desensitized. So I'm I'm just kind of waiting for what you're gonna do for level nine. Dude. I, I went through Mega Man, okay? I oh yeah, I remember <laughs> Mega Man! That was so awesome! <laughs> that was so awesome, man. Wish Elec Man was in this. Oh god, no. I'm so sick of Elec Man. <laughs> Especially after that final video. Oh god. Well, it was just... I just remember you having to do the same thing over and over again. I don't really remember why you had to do it. Well... In the final video? Well, yeah. I fought Electman over and over again Something. in various different games. Oh. Yeah, so yeah. here, you know, this looks like a door. It's a one-way wall on this end, and you can't go back through, and you have to do most of the dungeon over again. <sighs> Take it back to the side. So, and you don't really know where this has got you ending up, because you don't have a map. Oh, I, I know what the level looks like. Well, you, you know it, but... Yeah. Um, normal people. There aren't any reasonable people. This wall no. is a two-way wall. That's... You can that's go right good. back to the Triforce. That's good. However, because, you know, to get the raft, you gotta go through that wall. 
that's frustrated a lot of people. <laughs> frustrated a lot of people. <laughs> you mean it made it made small children, small isolate children, remind you. Um, it made them wander around for hours and hours longer to get to get their maximum enjoyment out of their Nintendo Entertainment Systems. Well, if you get to level five, you need the raft. Fuck! <laughs> what, about, what about the other ones? Um, level six... No, not level six. Level eight, you need the stepladder, which you get in level five. Um... <laughs> My god. So I can just imagine... I can just imagine someone who just doesn't really know any of this just going around and trying to turn over fucking everything and who you know, spending that? hours and hours at, at that and, you know, like bombing every wall and like getting maybe into that room in the dungeon and, you know, after like one of their overnighters and being ecstatic about it, going through that wall and just... I mean... Who, who Turn off would, the fucking game at that point, man. Yeah, who would think to go through the fucking wall in the Triforce room? That's the fucking well, actually, end of the dungeon. Well, actually, you... Do you remember Master Quest's, um... Ganon's challenges in that game? Uh, yeah. There was one in, like, the... It was, like, the light challenge, and the switch is just... It's, like, invisible, oh, and it's... Yeah. Like, impossible to find. I just... Man... I'm glad I didn't get any harder than that, because I didn't have something capable of save states at the time. Yeah, no, that is absolutely true. Alright, one more heart and we'll end the video. Cool. Where are you headed? Uh, Death Mountain. It's up there. Ah, uh, yes, the nondescript rocks and stairs area. Actually, um, it'd be faster to take this teleporter. This way I can warp. This is actually the wrong one. Or it's the right one. Fair enough. Uh, yeah, the nondescript stairs and everything is the same. Man, those those stairs in that cave are total MC Escher shit. Is he isn't he the one who did the one with that? really wacky perspective, you know, going all around and spinning on, like, upside down. That painting is just a yes. beautiful painting. <laughs> That's the highlight yes. of this game. That's the highlight of this video, shit. Uh, is that dull, huh? No, it's just that when you bring MC Escher into something, you know... <laughs> it's better than It's like he, he... He had the name MC before oh, he was... Oh, fuck! I didn't say MC. Oh, well. Yeah. Oh, come on, what do you want money for now? Uh, magic shield. Uh... uh I need the ma- Uh, candle would be nice. No. Alright. Uh, right Who would think to fucking play your fucking recorder in every single goddamn screen on the world map? And the off chance that, oh hey, a staircase appears. Well, probably the fuck in there? they own the game for a couple of years, and they just keep fucking around with it until they hear on um, the elementary school playground. My friend's cousin's uncle, who works in Nintendo, says that if you play the recorder here, yeah, I think if I think with kids, if you just keep that going, they'll they'll end up getting through the game, sure. and that's probably what Nintendo was thinking when they. Sh Shat this piece of shit out. Shat this piece of shit out, man. This I mean, really it's so shitty that there's just no other... There's just no other verb for it. They shat. <laughs> I happen it's... to like this game, but that's just because I'm a masochist. I can't get this yet, can I? I Whoa. Need two more hearts. Oh, you need four hearts, or what? No, I need, uh... That, uh, eight, twelve, fourteen hearts. No, that's too bad. No, I need 12 hearts, and I have 11. I need one more, which means one more dungeon. And then I go back there. Oh, Jesus. And you don't have a potion, either. Nope. I don't, nor uh, do I have the money to get a potion. So, you know what? Where's that red ring in this game? Uh, level 9. I'm just going to die. Ah, uh, that's right. And then we'll call it a video. Because... You know, I feel good about that. Dead.
do, 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 do. Yeah, we're gonna go down to save. Fuck this game! And we're gonna count my deaths. 24! That's not bad, actually. 24 deaths. So is there like a special bonus you get for limiting your deaths? Like some kind of reward? Uh, considering um, it counts saves and quits as deaths, I doubt it. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Anyway, yeah, that's the video. The reward, the reward is up here. <laughs> it, it's in the heart. Alright. It's in the heart, and it's also what you can say at bars. I'm holding a sword, and I think that's cool. Alright, I'm stabbing a You're not really holding it.